and consider taking a look at In this courses. video, I'm going to share it's with you a niche that I found that is starting to, um, to trend on Merch by how Amazon. Hello everyone, Amazon my name is Mike. I'm a full-time print-on-demand right, seller. So I make YouTube videos showing you how to make more money on Merch by Amazon and other print-on-demand websites. If you like this kind of content and you get any value out of this video, make sure to give this video a big uh, thumbs up. Okay, let's get into the content of this video. So the niche that I have for you guys today is one thing you might have already heard about, but it's teachers off duty. Um, the reason why this is trending is because the last day of school is coming up on June 27th. I mean, you can see right here, last day of school. Now, the only problem with this niche is that it's way too competitive. You're going to see there's over a thousand results. So just doing another teacher off duty shirt is not really going to be adding any value to the marketplace. You know, so what you want to do um, in this situation is you want to niche down. And one of the ways that you can niche down and actually scale this design is by focusing on specific types of teachers. So you don't want to, you don't want to just make like a teacher off duty sure you want to make like a science teacher off off duty or like a math teacher um, a PE teacher you can do kindergarten preschool teacher you know one through five fifth grade teacher sixth grade teacher etc etc now you also don't have to use teacher you can also use like principal off duty you can do assistant principal you can do superintendent you know so what you want to do with this niche that we can see is uh, sells well and is trending is to basically niche down scale it and then use other type of uh, professions and let me just go ahead and just show you some examples here. So like if we go to this um, Amazon page right here, here are some examples of what I'm talking about. Actually, I think it was this first one right here. So like this this uh, seller right here is doing a good job of it. Here you see they're not just doing a teacher after they're doing a music teacher, English teacher. You could also do like drama teacher, um, lunch lady, you know, who would have thought of that? Fifth grade, kindergarten. And you can see that these are were recently up, uploaded a couple months ago in April. Um, and they are selling. You can see they got good BSRs. So you want to do kind of something like this. Uh, but there's one niche that I found that was actually really low in competition and that I hadn't even really heard about. It kind of stuck out to me. And it is this one right here, which is Para Off Duty. You can see there's only 367 results. Right here, this is what I'm talking about. Para Off Duty. You can see just uploaded month month ago, March 20th, 2023. We can see it has a really good BSR at a good price of 17 or 18 bucks. Now, I didn't even really know what type of uh, niche or what type of teacher or what this is, so I just did a little research. Um, and if we see Para Professional, because if we go back, we're gonna see it says Para Professional in the title right there, so I just did a little research. And basically, a Para Professional is a person to whom a particular aspect of a professional task is delegated, but who's not licensed to practice at a fully qualified professional, whatever the hell that means. I don't know, but it's selling. Um, you know, you would want to check the trademark. I didn't check the trademark. I probably should have done that uh, before. But, you know, if it's if there's a whole bunch of them that are already selling, it's probably going to be okay. But again, always double check trademark just to make sure. But here we're going to see another one, Para Off Duty. Um, this is using the messy bun. We're going to see this was just recently uploaded a month ago in April. Uh, Para Off Duty, and it's got a BSR, not the best BSR, but it is selling. Let's see this one right here. That's another example. That one's not selling. Let's see if we can find some more ones. Okay, look at this. Para Off Duty, just recently uploaded. Really good BSR. So, you know, this is a good niche that you might want to uh, take a look at. This is the type of niches that we're looking for. We're looking for niches that are, you know, low in competition, that are selling, and that are trending. And this checks all of the boxes off. So, you know, make a design like this. Use similar keywords. Um, if you go to Creative Fabrica right here, and you just type in like teacher off duty, you can get a whole bunch of uh, designs that you can just upload. You just go to a uh, special license, click print on demand. And these ones right here, you get the special print on demand license. You can just upload these just as is. Um, I didn't check to see if there's a para off duty, but maybe you could take some of these, like some of these ones right here, and just add in, get rid of the teacher, and just add in para. So this would be a good idea right here if you have Photoshop skills or with Canva. You can just take these, edit them a little bit, use all the different types of teachers, like kindergarten, preschool, kind of like just I went over. Um, now, if you're interested in signing up with Creative Fabrica, I do have an affiliate link. In my description you just go right down here to where it says my favorite POD tools in the description creative fabrica this is an affiliate link so if you do sign up I do get a kickback but uh, creative fabrica is probably one of the best tools the best tools for um, print-on-demand designers or sellers they got a whole bunch of good stuff they got fonts they got oh got a sale um, they got fonts they got graphics they got uh, AI they even have courses they have a whole section just uh, 
just for POD right here. I think they're charging only like 59 bucks for the whole year, breaks down to like only $5 a month. So if you're interested, check it out. Um, and so that's the niche I have for you today. There was another niche that I also found that is starting to trend, but it wasn't super low in competition. Um, but I thought it was still good and it is make America straight again. So as of late, you know, this year, every year there seems to be like some type of like big, um, you know, basically a trend that is going on for the year. Like a few years ago, it was COVID, then it was the vaccine, then it was inflation, then it was gas prices. You know, there's always kind of like a big news story. And it seems kind of like one of the bigger news stories for this year has been, um, you know, transgender, um, you know, trans rights, things like that. And so this is the design, like kind of, kind of on the opposite side. It's a political niche. Me personally, I love these political niches. Um, I already popped off a few of these designs, but right here it's going to be Make America Straight Again. You can see this design was just uploaded May 24th, 2023. Already got a good BSR. Um, this one right here, May 24th, 2023. You can see it's already selling. And look how simple this is. I mean, this you just have to type out text. That's all you have to do. Upload up to Merch by Amazon. Um, now, this isn't super low in competition. Uh, I saw this trending a few days ago. I haven't been making videos because I was sick for like three weeks. I had a super bad sinus infection, so I apologize for um, lagging on the video content. I'm going to get back on it. I'm um, trying to get back to my usual schedule, one to two videos a week, um, so I can get this YouTube channel monetized. Still haven't gotten it monetized, so I got the subscribers. I just need the watch time. Um, but those are going to be the two niches for today. The one is the Para Profesional or para off duty and the other one is going to be make America straight again um, now if you're struggling with merch by Amazon or even with Redbubble um, I have a couple courses that you might be interested in here they are right here so one is a uh, shoot where is it let me get my face out of the way okay yeah, so here I have a merch by Amazon course uh, merch by Amazon for beginners, a step by step beginners guide for mastering merch by Amazon. I have it up on Udemy. I was selling this on Gumroad, but I put it up on Udemy because I think Udemy just has a little more um, credibility. And you can actually see the reviews. So here we're going to see it has 15 ratings, 4.4 stars, close to 1,500 students. Um, here are some of what the reviews or what people are saying about it. So, so I just need to get my face out the way. So right here we're going to see interesting material, well delivered, nice, calm, and honest way of presenting great info. Thank you. Awesome. Great. Perfecto. Thank you for training. And then you can actually see what the actual um, course is about. You can see each one of the, um, right here, the course content is what I was trying to say. So right here you're going to see what I go into. It's over an hour long. Um, this course is really good for beginners or for people that are struggling to get sales. And I also have one for Redbubble, Redbubble Masterclass, Step-by-Step -step Guide for Mastering Redbubble. You can also see the um, reviews, 4.7 course rating. Um, so check it out. These are, now I live in Mexico, so that's why the price says MX right here, but I think I have it priced at, at only like $9.99. So if you're interested in these courses or if you're struggling to get sales on Merch by Amazon or, or Redbubble, if you're looking for some guidance, you know, check out these courses. If you don't like them with Udemy, you can actually just refund them as long as it's within 30 days and get your money back. So if you think my course is trash, just refund it, get your money back. So you have really nothing to lose. Um, now, if we go ahead and we take a look at my credentials on Merch by Amazon. So I'm a tier 8,000 seller. I've done close to 12,000 sales. I'm about to hit 40,000 in revenue. Um, I usually do anywhere between 500 to a thousand dollars a month it just kind of depends on the time of year um, my sales honestly have gone down a little bit they were really jamming a couple of years ago um, when like I was doing all those political niches the Trump niches uh, it was really easy when uh, Trump was running you can just put up any type of Trump shirt cross niche it with any type of graphic like um, you know Mexicans Latinas um, students teens gays you know and it would sell I'm actually thinking about maybe getting back into that niche because, you know, there's another election coming up here. Uh, so that might be something for me to consider. Now, if we go ahead and we take a look at my credentials on Redbubble, we're going to see that over the past 12 months, I've done $1,800. My best month was last year, June 2020, or yeah, June 2022. Now, Redbubble sales are going to start to decline. My last month, it was only the 65 bucks. Usually I do like 155 or 150 to 200 bucks on Redbubble. But, you know, now that they made that change, you know, it's like damn near half. So that's a big kind of letdown. So it kind of sucks to see that. But that's how it is. You know, it's their platform. It's their rules, their sandbox. So, you know, if I want to 
you know, complain about. I can just leave the platform if I want, but I'm not going to do that because it's still just passive income and I can still upload new niches to hopefully maybe get something um, to stick and get lots of sales. So those are the two, uh, those are the two uh, courses I wanted to share with you. If you're interested, check them out. I'm going to have the links in the description and as a pinned comment. If you like this kind of content, consider subscribing to my channel. I put out videos, as long as I'm not sick, I put out videos on a regular basis, um, you know, talking about trending niches, design ideas, just ways our niches are low in competition are trending just ways to basically uh, for us to get sales on merch by amazon and other print on demand platforms like redbubble t public and etsy all right so that is going to be the video for today it's good to be back good to see you guys sorry i was um you know took a little mini vacation there but i'm going to be back on it hopefully get this channel uh, monetized and uh let's make some money all right so uh, thanks so much for watching and i'll see you on the next one bye bye